and a rebound pulled down by Thompson, a one and done for the Huskies. They haven't been on the boards offensively lately. I'm going to say if they score here, John needs a timeout. And the three is short. The offensive rebound is up, and the putback is in. Miles Certainly a, uh, a tough start for our guys to the year. You know, all the travels that we've uh, been on and, uh, you know, the teams that we've played. Um, you know, these guys have uh, continued to battle, um, you know, certainly through some tough circumstances. And uh, we challenged them uh, when we came back from Virginia Tech, um, you know, about the focus that we needed to play with every time we stepped on the court, whether it's a practice, a lift, or a competition. And, uh, you know, Coach Helton got after our guys um, in the locker room about that laser focus and, you know, what the purpose needs to be for our guys uh, when they step on the floor, both individually and as a team. And uh, I thought to start the game, our, our focus wasn't where it needed to be and give Bloomsburg credit. You know, they came in here and they were a little shorthanded after a long, you know, a long trip. And um, you know, I, I thought that they you know, punched us in the mouth and had us back on our heels a little bit. Um, and, and it had everything to do more with the defensive side of the basketball. But these guys responded, and, and I thought halfway through the uh, first half, we put together a little bit of a run. We, we got five straight stops, and it would open it up a little bit. And an, a defense rebound pulled down as Harriet couldn't finish the shots. Gaskins a three, and Gaskins will hit it. Yeah, it's nice to see Randall break out like that a little bit of gate. Steal. Gaskins lays off, and Wolford will throw it down. Another timeout by Coach Sano. To, to see the ball go in, you know, for, for Randall and you know, to see Isaiah go up and dunk, you know, certainly are two things that, you know, as a coach and as a staff and as a team are exciting with, you know, with all the things that Isaiah has gone through, um, you know, with his injury and then, you know, the, the early season struggles for Randall. It's neat to see those two kids perform, um, you know, and, and have some success here tonight. Now we need to build on that and put ourselves in a position to have that laser, laser focus on Friday. They're going to kick it up ahead. Isaiah Blackman by himself and Blackman! <laughs> Isaiah is back. <laughs> he is back. Um, I mean, when I went up, I didn't know I was gonna dunk it. To be honest, uh, I, I saw the lane. It was it was it was wide open. So I just figured, why not? So, well, actually, when I was working with Rich, I I could dunk. I always said like, Rich, watch me dunk, watch me dunk. <laughs> and he would he was like, No, you can't stop stop jumping. So I, it's just a secret. So. Just keeping the confidence that everybody told me to have. Uh, shoot the ball when I'm open, attack. So, I mean, it felt great. It felt great. Um, I was getting down on myself, not seeing the ball going, but seeing the ball going made me feel better. But just keeping the confidence throughout the whole year. That flash leading by 30. Thompson, nice shot, fake one dribble pull up from the elbow, and it swishes home. Yeah, basketball is such a confidence game, a momentum game, you know, and, and certainly we've struggled offensively early. So that confidence is something that, um, you know, hopefully we can build on. You know, you can talk about it and, you know, certainly we, you know, talk to Randall or talk to Isaiah and that talk is one thing, whether it's be from the players or for the coaches, but for them to experience it, you know, it's, it's invaluable.